Hey guys, and welcome to Crypto Mining Insider. I have something important to talk to you about. It's actually explosively important. Gigabyte has a recall on two power supply units. They're the 750 and the 850 watt units. They were sold to the general public as well as distributed through channels like Newegg as part of bundles. I know because I actually got a couple of them last year as part of graphic card drops. They were bundled with them, buy the graphic card, get this power supply with it. I had it and I was using it on a mining rig. I just received this email from Newegg too saying hello. This email is being sent to you concerning a recent public statement from Gigabyte relating to a product. Our records indicate you have previously purchased from Newegg. It goes on to show the products. It shows the model numbers and the serial numbers. If you have one of these power supplies, the GPP850GM or the GPP750GM, here's the serial numbers that it lists in my Newegg email. Plus, do your own research too. Make sure your unit is not one of the ones listed here. So if you own one of these Gigabyte 750 or 850 watt power supply units, please stop using it and see if it's part of the recalled units. There is a known issue that can cause a malfunction and cause the unit to catch fire or even combust. I also highly recommend you watching the Gamers Nexus who covers this in depth. They do a lot of experimentation and you'll see the faulty units. Some of them are even showing more higher than a 50% failure ratio. Anyway, I don't want to be a spoiler, but it's a great video. Watch it and the results are pretty convincing and seem pretty conclusive to me. So my mining rig right now, I have three cards down. So I have my 3080, 3070, 3070, 3070s on, but I have two 3070s and a 3080 that's offline right now. It's because of this one right here. It's a gigabyte. 850 watt power supply and they're doing a recall from it so i gotta send it back to get my money but i'm not gonna chance running this thing because apparently if something goes wrong with it it can either combust or explode what started out as appearing to be a simple switch of the power supply which was a bad explosive potentially gigabyte 850 we put in this brand new 800 by EVGA. You notice too, side by side, even EVGA is, EVGA is got to be almost an inch and a half longer. I was actually able to get a great deal on this one. It's probably about $100, which is about $50 off. You keep your eye out for promotions. Actually, I got a plenty of EVGA site. But we, I use this for I'm going to be going in and tearing all the wires out anyway. It was a good time. So I actually cut all my original zip ties off. I originally wasn't using these, these reusable ties on Amazon. I'll show a link below if you're interested. But these are great because you can put wires on, pull it back, you do it until you get everything right. Next stuff. You can see though, I changed the bottom deck on the money thing. So I used to have slats. And you know, used to have board on the end, board, 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 board. And kind of had a little bit of flex. But when you have seven, eight cars on a ring, so it's becoming pretty heavy, like 50 pounds for the day. Plus, you can the power supply in the car. So, this actually is kind of like, lack of better words, we're, we're going to pimp out this rig. We're going to get put everything back, tie it up nice, and hopefully it'll be running for years and years to come. So, right here, I have seven cards. I have one, two, three, four. I have five thirty seventies, and I have two thirty eighties. Uh, this is one of my favorite cards. They're very, very beefy, very thick radiators. They don't produce much heat, they're very quiet. You can see right here is a 3070. If you look, you can see the difference too. A 3080, see just that extra heat coming out. It's really very, very well designed car. And unfortunately, I don't think they're making this. Is the full hash 3080? I, I don't even think they're making these anymore. And I hope they are anyway. So let me get to work on this and we'll cut back as we make our progress. So stay tuned.
Uh-oh. Nice. So we just got the rig back in its home right now and all seven parts are showing up and all lit up beautifully. And if you notice here, you can see the seven GPUs and they're all mining okay. Very happy that this is up and running. I see all seven parts, devices zero through six. And right now I'm still running a little warm right now, but 1300 watts for this rig alone. And that's just the rig and the fans. So I'm gonna play with the other clocks a little bit more, get the numbers back to where they were. But the main thing is, is I have one, two, I have these three cards back now. So that's 220 mega hash back online. So we have a 500 mega hash rig and mission accomplished. Whoa. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have, please give us a big thumbs up like, smash down on that subscribe button if you haven't already. We love and we welcome all your questions and comments. Please put them down below. We'll do our best to answer them as quickly as we can. And until the next video, happy mining.